Well, um, you know, in, in a way, the magnificent work I'm doing since six and a half uh, was was my formal training. Um, I was going. I, I first went to a stage school when I was five, um, but that lasted for about a year. And then um, went to another stage school um, called Corona, um, where I was nine. And um, the magnificent six and a half was uh, the, the, the the following year. Um, so uh, I think you, you learn or by, by doing things and actually being at school. Um, so whenever I, I got a part, I was always, um, I always learned, learned far more from, from, from that than from, from, from actually the action lessons. Well, they, they, for the Magnificent Six and a Half, they um, auditioned um, hundreds and hundreds of children at the time, which is 1967. Um, and um, at uh, the, the end of it, um, the 20th Century Fox said that they didn't want any children from six and a half. Um, and so that when they, they did the double decades, um, they auditioned um, about 2,000 children. And um, then they sent um, tapes to Hollywood of six and a half together with the audition tapes of the children who'd been, in, who'd been auditioning. Um, and it probably isn't, it wasn't, wasn't a really fair comparison because um, obviously when you're um, in, in a professional production, that's going to look a lot better than a screen test can. Um, but they, 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 they decided that it would be okay to, to use um, the pair of us. But uh, it would it, it, be nice for there to be something because people are still interested in the show. Oh, yeah. Um, but. Uh, and, and I think people, you know, if they, if they were able to show it again, and, and I think you get good tickets and again. People, yeah, do do, do enjoy it, but uh, making it fresh, you'd have to do it differently now. I think you know, the, the song and dance done with the slapstick and all the rest of it, you you wouldn't be able to do with a straight face in the way in which we did it. <laughs> I think it is uh, people. Uh, I mean, I'm not even saying it couldn't be done, but you, you'd have to find a different way of doing it. That's, that's absolutely right, yes. Uh, and this, this, the set wouldn't have lasted a year, um, and, and I'm sure by the moment they decided they weren't going to make it again, um, that, that would have been it. Um, in actual fact, part of the set um, came from the six and a half. In any case, you'd always come across bits of equipment that had been lying around, which I recognised from three years before. Um, but uh, so these things are, aren't usually wasted. But I mean, if it had been disassembled, um, you know, shortly after we, we filmed it, and um, then they actually um, knocked down the whole part of, of the studios. About at least half the studios we, we filmed it in um, was redeveloped a few years ago in our, in our supermarket. Um, my favourite episode was one, the one with the uh, hovercraft fight itself. Um, simply because there's, there's a lot of me in it, and that I, I was told that that was the first, uh, once it was first shown on American television, it was the first one to be broadcast, and it starts off with me calling the, the rest of the gang together. So, just from an egotistical point of view, it's, um, uh, that, that's the one that I like the most. It's got a lot to me in it. It's so enjoyable to do that um, you, know, you act uh, good days and bad days like everything else. Um, but uh, quite frankly, that, that was just you know, a wonderful show to be involved in. And it, 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 it was you know, so much fun. Um, I, I can't look back and you know, think of anything bad, but then they made one that was being selected. But uh, on the whole, um, you know, it, it, it was all funny, even having buckets of water thrown over you. Um, so it seemed so okay at the time. Are you still in contact with L Street Studios in any way? Not really. I mean, I, I went up there um, a couple. Of, oh no, hang on. Then I got up there. Um, actually, I, I went up there last year um, because I um, directed a short film, and the uh, director of photography was working on another film up there, and I went up to see him for a meeting. So uh, yeah, I've been up there, I guess, three or four times in the last ten years. So not not that much. I mean, um, obviously, the 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 the